Hey guys, on today's video, we're gonna be downloading a lot of free stuff right here from your PlayStation Plus membership. So let's just go right into your PlayStation Plus, and from there, just scroll to the right, and we're gonna see a lot of stuff. So right here, we should see PS Plus exclusive packs and more stuff in here, of course. So we're just gonna let this load, and we're gonna see a lot of stuff that we can download right now, and it's for free as long as you guys are members. So right here, we can see exclusive, we can download all these. Now I'm gonna go throughout the whole list, and then we're gonna start downloading all these add-ons, packs, and other stuff that's available for us PS Plus members. So if you scroll down, you're gonna see a lot of stuff. So the list goes down up to around here, and there we go. So let's just start from the beginning. Our very first pack add-on that we can download is right here. So let's just click on it and download. Yes, just click on download and there you go. If after download it says unavailable or anything like that, don't worry about it. Most likely you guys can go into the game and just confirm that you guys have this. Let's just go back for now. We're gonna take a look at this. Now we do have this as well, so you can go right into it. Then hit download. And this is the exact message that I told you guys about when it says not available for purchase. That's okay. We can just go and verify it later on. Now we're going to do the same thing with Final Fantasy. Download. And this one's actually downloading, which is good. So this is a cloud theme. It's a little bit different than our other ones that we have seen before. Then we have our Fortnite one, which it says unavailable. That's because I already made a video about it where I clicked on it and I downloaded it. Then we're gonna go into this guy right here. We're gonna hit on download. And yes, you guys can hit on download on every single one of these. And it's okay if it says unavailable. So we're gonna hit right there. Now this one's one of those that it's a little bit different. So it's okay. Now we're supposed to see download free. Perfect, let's just do that, download free. And there we go, it started downloading. Now this is seven gigs, so it's different than everything else that we've been downloading from before. It will take quite a bit in order for it to fully download the whole bundle. But for now, let's just get out of it. We're gonna keep scrolling down. We're also gonna see Warface face right here. So we're gonna go ahead, download it as well. Then we have Star Trek. So we're just gonna go over it, click on it, download as well. Dogfighter, same deal. We're gonna just download this. Now this is another add-on, so we're just gonna go ahead, click on it, download again. Again, it's not a big deal if it says not available for purchase. You guys already downloaded it, so it's okay. And I'm gonna show you how to verify that, which is just going to your game and seeing that you guys actually do have that. So this one says purchase, perfect. It's better once it says purchase than obviously not available, because that makes sense. Sometimes these mistakes happen, but that's all right, guys. So we're just gonna keep going through all these and downloading every single one of these for you guys to see how it's done. And I'm gonna show you that it's okay that it says not available because it is working regardless of that message. So we're just gonna hit on download. Now this bundle should be pretty fast in downloading so I shouldn't really have to worry about that not available. That's okay. We're just gonna confirm that later on. We're gonna go into this guy, download it as well. There we go, purchased. I prefer getting that message, obviously. We're gonna go into this guy, download as well. Let's see what happens. There we go, it's downloading the pack, good. I can just get out of it while it's doing that. It should say purchased. I don't really have to wait for it and just download the whole thing. If it's something like the other one that we had seven gigs, it, again, don't have to worry about that. Let's just go down, we have this as well. Might as well download it go it's okay that it says that now we have this guy right here this should be a quick download as well and we have this guy let's just click on download there we go if we go down we're gonna see this guy we're gonna hit download now as you guys can see it's the same thing for every single one of these and yes even if you don't have the game, you guys can download the add-on and download the game later on. That way you guys already have the add-on and you're ready to go. So even if you don't have one of these games, go ahead, download the add-on. It's free, it's not charging you anything, it won't harm you. And a lot of these add-ons don't even take any space on your internal storage in your PlayStation. It's just an add-on for the actual game. So that actually just stays in your history of the game itself. 
Now there are other things that we have downloaded. You guys saw that seven gigs or something like that. Well, those are different. We're gonna download this as well. So just go into this personal three. There we go. Theme. Well, this is just the theme. So this will actually take some space on your PlayStation, but it's only 13 megabytes. So for most of you, that should be okay. We can delete any of these things later on, any themes that you guys don't like, go ahead and delete them, it's no big deal. So this is another theme. Again, we can just delete it later on. We have Terra right here. We're just gonna hit on download. Not available for purchase, not a problem. Right now, what I'm doing is updating Fortnite and uh, that's one of the things that we're gonna be testing out so you guys can see that, how it works, uh, plus a few other ones. You guys are gonna see that although it said not available, we should be okay. So this one says free, it doesn't say exclusive, which is weird. It should say PS exclusive, but let's just download it. It is free after all. As long as you guys don't see a price or anything like that or verifying a certain amount of money, then again, it should just be free. Again, all these things are included with your PS Plus membership. So we don't have to really worry about purchasing anything because this is 100% free. Let's just go back. Again, any theme, something like that, we can edit those later, take them out if you guys don't want them. But right now, they're gonna download pretty fast because they're only a couple megabytes. You guys can apply those themes. I do have a separate video, by the way, showing you guys how to apply themes, take out themes, even make your own custom theme for your PlayStation, just like I have for mine. So we're just gonna click on download. Should start, there we go. Downloading. Once it starts downloading, you guys can get out of it. Don't have to wait. If this refreshes, because we're all the way down there, don't worry about it. Just, just go back, go all the way down, and see where we have to keep going from. So here we go. We have Switchblade. Gonna go ahead and download this. Same deal with this guy. So we should see this exclusive avatar settings. Yep, this is your set. So we can go into avatar settings. And from here, we can see our premium avatars. We can go ahead and choose any one of these, since again, they came in with our PlayStation Plus membership. So we'll go ahead and apply any of them just by clicking on them. For now, we're just gonna go back, go all the way back, and then we have Warface, and we're just gonna hit on download it again. Not available for purchase, that's okay. I mean, it just downloaded actually. And then we have Terra Tech. Oh, this is another pack, perfect. Let's just click on download, purchased, perfect. Same deal, we're clicking on download. I'm gonna go back. Then we have, yep, this guy right here. I'm gonna click on download. And we're gonna go throughout the whole list. Well, you guys get how this is done. <laughs> we're just clicking on download every single one of these and it's okay if we see not available no big deal now this is a huge pack so we can download it for free not available for purchase again that's okay so you guys can see it's downloading it says added to downloads so it is downloading and that's why i told you guys not to worry about any games that say not available once you guys hit download it actually already downloaded or it's in the process of downloading the actual pack or bundle or anything that we're downloading at the moment. So we're gonna go back again, not available, that's okay. Let's see this guy right here, gonna hit download. Yeah, not available, again, it's okay. That just means downloading or it already downloaded. Now some of these packs are really, really good that they're giving us to us for free. It's uh, the same thing every month they're giving us two free games that we can download. It's something that you guys have, do have to keep up. And if you guys want to check those out, I always have a video running on which games are actually available every single month. Then we have tanks. This is the same deal. You just have to set the avatar. So I'm gonna click on set avatar. And once I do that, in this case, it's just gonna apply it. So there we go, we just apply that. Probably change it later on, but for now that's okay. Uh, then we have this guy right here. I'm gonna download this. Purchase perfect. Then we see this pack. 
yeah, well, this is a theme. I'm gonna hit on download the theme. And like I mentioned before, any themes, if you guys don't want them to take that space, although it's a couple megabytes and that's it, we can always delete any themes and clean up. Or if you guys just wanna keep one theme, we can just clean that theme up. And um, there is a video, separate video, which I mentioned already that I made about themes and uh, how to make your own custom theme, how to change your theme and all that stuff. This is DC Universe. Again, doesn't really matter if it says not built, purchased. We already did. No need to worry about it. We're gonna download. Not gonna wait for it to download. I'm just gonna head out and it's added to my download, so I'm okay with that. Farming Simulator, yep, I'm gonna download this as well. There we go, I'm gonna go back. I'm just gonna let it do its thing. I'm gonna go back into Casino and download this. And it's been downloaded, good. Then we have this guy right here. I'm gonna download this as well. It's actually the same process for every single one of these. I just have to download if it gives me an error. It's not a problem. If it's not available, it's okay. We can just go ahead and keep downloading because it is actually downloading the background or it already downloaded it and we're good to go. And you guys don't really have to wait for it to fully download in order to go into the next one and just go ahead and download that exclusive. So that's exactly what we're doing. We're going one by one and we're just downloading each one without having to wait for the others to finish up downloading. And there's a bunch of, for these guys, yeah, there's, there's, there's a ton. For this, there's a ton of stuff right now that we can download, which is great. It's a little bit too much, I would say, but <laughs> it's good that we get all this for free for this specific game. So yes, there was a ton of stuff for this game for free right now. I was really surprised by that. And then we have our very last players right here. So we're gonna download this as well. Purchase, perfect. Then we have this tomorrow. Download as well. As soon as it says to go back here, I'm gonna get out of it because it's purchased. And same thing with this guy. Well, these are an avatar setting. So we're gonna do exactly that. Go in avatar settings. And then we're gonna be able to change it up to that. Now avatar settings do take a little bit more in order to load. It's just loading avatars right here on your PlayStation. Once it loads, we can go ahead and change that avatar right here into this avatar or any other avatar. That's exactly what we're gonna do. We're gonna set this avatar, as you guys can see, and we can just confirm that. And that's how you guys can set that avatar that we got right now. Let me just go back. Uh, by the way, we can always change that later on. It's not a problem. Then we have our very last option. And we're gonna download this as well. Hopefully there isn't that unavailable thing. And there isn't, it says purchased. So perfect. So right now what we're gonna do is just confirm any one of these. So for example, in some of these, we got that message that said unavailable, right? Such as this Fortnite one or any one of these actually, they all said unavailable, which is not true. It's available, you already downloaded it, it's good to go. We can actually just go into the game and verify that it is. So for example, this Fortnite one right here, which I already tried, it says not available for purchase, it's okay. Let's go right into Fortnite and see what's going on. We're gonna go all the way back. I wanna check out Fortnite at this point in time. Now that's just an example. It's gonna be the same thing with any of your games. Now this one's still downloading, by the way. Now this guy, we can start up. 
and we're gonna go into Fortnite. So we're just gonna go right into Fortnite and then we should see that everything's good. So we're gonna just log in and I should see that message up there. Your purchase items are waiting for you. <laughs> so that's a good thing, that's a good sign, okay? So any game that you guys have might say that. Not all games, but some of your games. So let's just go into Battle Royale, for example. And as long as I log in, I should see this. So for example, right now, this acquired. So I can equip it or just go next. I'm still gonna have it. And same thing goes with the backpack. I can just claim it or equip it. I'm just gonna claim it. So if I go right into my item shop, not item shop, sorry, locker, I'm gonna see right here, my first option. I should have that option down here below. So here we go. So here's my option. So I can just go ahead and save it and change it up there. Same thing goes with my backpack. I can go ahead and select a new backpack or I can put any other one. So as long as you guys see that it's right here, you should be good to go. Now there is another one that I've downloaded from before, but any one of them, you guys can put them at this point in time. So I'm just gonna go back. I'm gonna change up my skin. And anyways, that's how you guys can verify that the packs and everything downloaded actually does work. And that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.